Good afternoon. It's a great day, but I'm not walking the trail today. I have too many things. I uh, appeared in court at a distance from my law office, and uh, right now I'm for the first time at the end of the pandemic having someone look at my car, <laughs> and I'm surrounded by people who are coughing. Um, the, the news today focuses on Rudy Giuliani, in my opinion. I don't know what the Hill is doing, having cutting a deal with Republicans and then independently doing something else. So I think I'll wait and see how that finally settles down before I have a comment on it. Uh, but I think when you do something in politics, it really should make sense if you expect people to support it. Rudy Giuliani uh, has been lying for a long time. He's been lying in court. He's been lying at press conferences. He's been appearing before uh, different panels in different states mostly about the election, but not exclusively. And so finally, uh, his uh, chickens have come to roost. <laughs> New York Bar Association uh, has suspended his license. And they've suspended his license not as a punishment, but to protect the public. Uh, and they, it's very rare that they do this without the hearing beforehand. And they've done it without a hearing, although one will follow, because they think he is such a danger to the community. On the, at the same time today, Rudy Giuliani is appearing in D.C. court on the Dominion case, which, if you remember, is the case involving him lying, uh, again, about uh, the Dominion voting system and claiming that it could do all sorts of things that would prejudice the election against Mr. Trump. Well, the trouble with that is the same, <laughs> the same voting machines were used in elected Republicans. And between what Trump said and the Republicans who profited from the machine, I would think it would be safe to say that it was neutral. Now, the, the ticket for their charges are they're asking for a billion dollars in relief. So uh, those are the two things that I think I'm going to be talking about with Jason Johnson this evening. Uh, Ari Melber is not going to be on uh, MSNBC, and uh, Jason is going to sit in for him. And he and I are going to talk about this at about 6.25 p.m. And hopefully I'll get to post this before, <laughs> before that event so you can see it. Otherwise, um, get out and walk someplace. And I may walk tonight, but uh, it'll probably be dark. And uh, except for hearing my voice floating in the darkness, I think we can do better than that. So this is a little short because I'm just standing here sitting here rather with a, a nice red uh, umbrella over my head and a wind in my face and uh, i bet you it's great on the trail so talk to you tomorrow from the trail all the best bye bye